let's take a look at the lesson equivalent coins one it says complete the money equation below five dimes is equal to how many half dollars well I know that dimes are worth ten so we can count by ten five times ten twenty thirty forty fifty I can see that when we have one ten there's a one in the tens place. When we have two tens, there's a two in the tens place. Three tens, there's a three in the tens place. Four tens, there's a four in the tens place. And five tens, there's a five in the tens place. So looking at this, I could have thought five tens or five dimes is 50 cents. All right, so we know that this is worth 50 cents. Well, a half dollar is half of a dollar. If a hundred cents is a whole dollar half of a hundred is 50 so a half dollar is 50 cents so now we know that five dimes is worth 50 cents and one half dollar is worth 50 cents so now they are equal five dimes is equal to one half dollar next we have 25 pennies is equal to how many quarters well, I know each penny is worth one cent. So if I have 25 of them, I would count up to 25. So 25 pennies is 25 cents. I also know that a quarter is worth 25 cents as well. So in order to make these equal, we would say 25 pennies is equal to one quarter because one quarter is worth 25 cents. Now this says 10 pennies is equal to how many dimes? Well, I know each penny is worth one cent, so 10 pennies is 10 cents. And I also know that a dime is worth 10 cents. So 10 pennies is equal to one dime. Here we have 10 nickels is equal to how many quarters? Well, I know that nickels are worth five cents each, and if I need 10 of them, I need to count by fives 10 times. So I would have five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. All right, that was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So 10 nickels is 50 cents. So now quarters are worth 25 cents each, so I can count by 25s until I get to 50 because we want to make these equal. So 25, 50, oh, there we go. It was just two, two quarters is equal to 10 nickels. Here we have 10 nickels is equal to how many half dollars? Do you remember how much a half dollar is worth? Yes, 50 cents. Great. So now let's see how much 10 nickels is. Do you remember when we counted by fives 10 times? Let's try again. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is 50 cents if we have 10 nickels. So if these are each worth 50 cents, we only need one to make this equal because 10 nickels is equal to 50 cents, but one half dollar is equal to 50 cents. Now we have four nickels is equal to how many dimes? So I know that each nickel is worth five, so I can count by fives four times. Five, 10, 15, 20. 
All right. Now I know that my dimes are worth 10 cents, so I can count up by tens until I reach 20 because I want these both to be equal. So this side needs to equal 20 as well. So 10, 20, ah, there we go. There were only one, two dimes. So four nickels is equal to 20 cents and two dimes is equal to 20 cents. Now we have 50 pennies is equal to how many half dollars? Well, I know a penny is worth one. So if we have 50 of them, it would be 50 cents or 50 pennies. And do you remember how much a half dollar is? If a whole dollar is 100 cents, half of that is 50. So a half dollar is 50 cents. Wait, 50 cents is equal to 50 cents. So we only need one half dollar because one half dollar is 50 cents. Next we have how many nickels is equal to one half dollar. So we know one half dollar is 50 cents. So let's count by fives since a nickel is five until we reach 50. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. All right, how many was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten nickels is equal to one half dollar. They would both be equal to 50 cents. Here we have how many pennies would be equal to one half dollar. Remember, our half dollar is 50 cents. It is half of 100 cents. So one half dollar is 50 cents. So how many pennies would we need to get 50 cents? Yeah, 50 pennies because each penny is worth one cent. So we would need 50 of them. Then we would have 50 cents is equal to 50 cents. Now we have how many half dollars is equal to two dollars. So these are dollar coins. So I know that I need two dollars and each of these are half of a dollar. So let's see if we have half of a dollar that is 50 cents. If we have another half that is 100 cents. So we could also write 100 cents as one dollar. Well, if we need two dollars, we're going to need 200 cents. So let's count by our 50s. 50, 100, 150, 200, 200. Ah, okay. So here we would have a dollar 50. And here we would have two dollars. So we would need one, two, three, four half dollars for it to be equal to two dollars. Amazing work. Thanks for your help, friends.